Yeah. Hey everyone, it's me, Alex. Uh, just f giving you a bit of context for what this video is and why... I don't know, you'll see in a second, like, what's going on, but, uh... Basically what happened is I was doing some file organizing and I happened to stumble across an old as they say on how it should have ended, um, the YouTube channel that we recorded on the 18th of November, 2019. Um, so I figured might as well put it together. I think we'd over the years kind of considered it a uh, mean spirited video or something like that. But um, I've listened through it, obviously edited it. I think it's funny. Um, it's a weird flash from the past time capsule thing now because it's been so many years. It's pre the C virus and everything. We're all quite different people in this um so yeah just thought i'd give some context as to what it is and why the set's different and why we all probably sound and look a bit different as we are now hope you enjoy yeah good afternoon morning evening or night ladies and gentlemen we are jar jamie james and alex that's me and today we are going to be discussing something very, very dear to our hearts. Something rather quite personal to me, in fact. Hence why you're hosting, you're... Hence why I'm... Taking charge on this bad boy. Sat on the the hot seat, if, if you want to use a metaphor such as that. I'm not going to beat around the bush. You've seen the name of the video, you clicked on the video. Or else you're not seeing the video. We're... we're we're talking about, what is it, his, hissy. his, he, hissy, hissy, Hish. how, Hish. it should have ended. What does he call, the, he, I said we were watching a string of them and I was like, oh, he calls them, hissies. Yeah, hissies. Hello everyone, I'm back. Was it hissy? It, it I was. I think so, hiss, hissy, hissy. Ah. I always read it as hoish. How it <laughs> should have ended. Heish. Oh no, why? Why would you do that? Welcome to the uh, the latest Heish. What is how it should have ended, Jim? How it should have ended is a, a long, long, long running YouTube series where they take a popular movie such as <laughs> The Dark Knight. Endgame. Any, any, any blockbuster, but any, mon any movie that makes lots of money, they do a funny animated video on making jokes about how it should have ended, about how the movie should have ended. That's the gimmick. That is the gimmick. And it's not the truth though. <clears throat> no, it's not the truth. I mean, we can start there because the, the name of the videos is kind of a lie. You know? Yeah, it's like a hook to get people in. It's yeah. like just a branding thing. Yeah, I mean, where where do we really want to start on the what what? Well, the the reason I didn't want to host is because I basically have one thing to say about this channel, and it's that they make the same video over and over again, and that's like the whole thing. The thing is, if they'd have been going for like a year, and they kept doing the same thing, it's like all right, I'm sure. Yeah. Eventually, some sort of evolution is going to happen. But, I mean, they, they've they been going for at least 10 years, right? I would have thought so, yeah. They've been around the block a few times. Yeah, more than twice. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. We know a lot of you have been waiting for this episode. But um, they've, they've got their, like, three jokes that they use. Uh, they've got more than one? No, they, they've got the same three ten-year-old jokes that they use in every video, and then every other joke is a reference <coughs> in some way to something else. Well, this is how you make an uh, How It Should Have Ended video, right? Blockbusters on the horizon. You don't even know, need to go see it. You start production based on what is in the trailer and what people are talking about on Reddit. So, yeah, what happens is the film comes out maybe you go see it maybe you don't you go on r slash movies you go to whatever thread there is about the film and then you just filter by like top rated comments and you see all the jokes everyone's making and then you go on twitter and you see you go like hashtag infinity war you see what people are saying 
and you gather all the like the most obvious blatant jokes anyone could think of and everyone is talking about and then in the video you just recreate scenes but incorporating the the reddit comments in and that's how it should have ended it is quite literally a reddit lifeline <laughs> there is not a single ounce of originality to this channel at all the the issue is is that like it has been going on for so long you know it, it's it, tired it's extremely tired you know how can how can they stay passionate when like the it's a group collective channel like that's what bugs me so much about this kind of thing where it's like okay first off it's animated but visually it's so embarrassingly bad like that that's not why you're watching it so then it falls back on the writing and the jokes but none of it's actually clever or like is suggesting ways it should have gone aside from stuff that's just the most obvious shit that everyone on mm -hmm. The internet's already saying. Take out all the like original stuff from something like Rick and Morty and just leave the reference humor and like the most obvious shit imaginable. And then you have how it should have ended. It's like Family Guy without any of the original stuff. It's as vapid as like disaster movie in the way they would like satirize by just doing the same thing that was in the movie but with like silly voices. Speaking of voices, they the they voice attempt to is... do impressions of a bunch of the characters, and I was thinking about South Park and how there's that like thing at the front of South Park that says we're we're doing impressions really poorly or whatever, mm -hmm. and how it should have ended doesn't even have that. It's just it needs it because like yeah, there is a there's like a running gag though in like South Park of the way that like basically every voice is done by the two guys. Yeah. And you sort of like that that's part of the joke in a way. Mm -hmm. But there isn't anything like funny or charming about how it should have ended. Cause like. No, like the delivery of the jokes is very. It's like clearly bad. a dorky. It's really dorky and nerdy. And it's written from the perspective no, of that... someone who does like. Who is like on the pulse of like media. They read Screen Rant. But you know what I can do? What's that? Make an incredibly awesome movie. For me, though, part of what makes it annoying is the the animation angle, because it's like, okay, you're you're choosing animation to be your your like style, right? Mm -hmm. You've got some artists slash artists um, and animators who are putting together this stuff, and there is like a how it should have ended art style, but my problem is. M most, well, like, from what I can figure out or guess, a lot of their artwork is traced. All you have to do is go to, like, any frame from one of their videos, mm -hmm. and you'll see some some more than others stand out, like, in particular in the Meg one, Rain Wilson's, like, characters, very obviously traced. Yeah. And in the Captain Marvel one I think we watched, there's, like, a scroll, and I was like... Let me just pause this. And I went on Google and just Googled Captain Marvel scrolls and like found like one of the stock pictures of a scroll and held it up next to it on the screen and was and like, they were pretty much identical. Yep, the angle's the same, it's all the same. So it's just like traced. Which is fine, like I'm okay with animation being used to like propel some kind of like funny writing or whatever. Like mm -hmm. loads there's loads of like awful animation out there like South Park we already mentioned it's not like got good animation or anything but it's yeah. made in like a week looks like shit like it's all about the the jokes and the content and it is just like it's for children we watched the Lion King one and it's like there is just nothing here for adults and that's that's all you can really say about it is it's like you can only really watch it if you are like 10 yeah, maybe maximum of like fourteen, fifteen, because that's when I used to genuinely watch it. Like I, I, I never, I've never watched it. I've, I've never. Seriously, I mean, it, to I remember when honest. Cinema Sins first arrived. I watched yeah, that yeah. for a bit until like a week later. It was like, oh, all right, I get it now. And the, I, there are some parallels between how it should have ended in Cinema Sins to me. Um, yeah, it's it, it's kind of like um, the Little Britain of YouTube videos, like with catchphrase humor, 
and just doing the same thing over and over again and people just sort of love it. But it is it is a formula and you either yeah. like that formula or you don't. But I don't I don't know how people can not get bored of a formulaic thing like The that. bar is so low in terms of like parody content on YouTube where like this is considered good parody as far as YouTube standards go. Mm. Which is like a sad state because like it is some of the worst humor. There's not a single hissy video I've seen where I even smiled. Like there is n so little there that there's it's meaningless. Yo. And the big problem is it overstays its welcome to mm. extremes. It there'll be a point where it's just like this can end, and they'll they'll drag it on for like another seven minutes. <laughs> it's. F Appalling. We must have watched 10 plus of these goddamn videos it felt, just in a row. It just felt yeah. like one really long one. And we just sat there in complete silence. Yeah. Because each video is like edited. It will just be a part of the movie, like the beginning of the movie. And then joke, and then just random cut to. They're like the little movie. vignettes of the movie, yeah. aren't they? They're like, okay, in Infinity War, what are the scenes people are talking about and joking about? Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll animate those, or we'll trace over those a little bit animate a scene based on the joke that everyone's saying on Reddit. And then when that joke's played its course, then but to the, the next joke. The issue is, like, the the jokes don't have punchlines. No, or when they do, it's like just a reference to something. Yeah, which yeah. isn't a punchline. It, it's just a joke, but it's just like a statement. There's no joke and punchline, it's just... Yeah, it's like, I, I would prefer... Personally, it's just a taste like or preference thing. It's like, so what do you actually think then at the end of the mm. day? Like it's it's pointless. Like it, I suppose in terms of it, like capturing the top level, like most forgettable, meaningless discussion of movies. It's like capturing that in like a little pod, and that's all the the videos like really mean. Yeah. So if you want to see what like, oh, that's the dumb shit people were complaining about when that film came out. Go to like the how it should have ended on. That's the only like quality I can really think of that that they they have in terms of entertainment value for me. It's just like a slight encapsulation of whatever was going on in pop culture at the mm -hmm. time. But you, you're never gonna do that though. You're never gonna want to know the shit parts of Yeah. It's pop it's culture. a it's a total embodiment of everything I cannot stand about like fanboy fan culture yeah where it's like wh why do you actually like these things then is it just because of the like iconography and the imagery and the catchphrases and shit is that the only reason you like it and like it's enough for you to just like have the same character just pop up in every video just saying the same joke the same punchlines like which character would that be let me batman explain this to you you don't just tell girls they should smile which character would what be what are you talking about? I've been here the whole time. Did I tell you my parents are dead? My parents are dead. Because I'm Batman! The Batman shit. The what? Who? I don't, don't want to say it, but... It's, it's cringe. It's King terrible. They've played that whole Batman thing for like 10 years. They need to just move on. Who... Who laughs at this Batman thing at this point? What's the line he always says again? I can't quite remember. Oh, my parents are dead! It's me, Batman. Is it's me, Batman! Is that what he says? I'm pretty it's because sure Because it's that's... me, because I'm Batman. It's that kind of... That, that was actually it. I thought you guys actually knew, but clearly you didn't. <laughs> that's the joke that... Is it every, um... As far as we can tell, every comic book movie that they do... At least. Because I'm Batman is in it. That's right. Because I'm Batman. Yeah. We, do, we don't have the patience, time, or really interest in going through every one of their videos and seeing how many times Batman shows up. But if one of you want to do it, like, go and report in the comments. I'm sure it's, well, how many videos have they uploaded? Just round but estimate based on that. Funnily enough, I remember seeing um, in the, the JAR Reddit, somebody... Uh, put a clip of the Spider-Man one that we watched and 
they lead up to Batman saying because I'm Batman, but he actually says because I'm a I'm an adult or something. Right? And they're like, oh my god, how it should have ended actually changed a joke for once. <laughs> and Which Spider Man was this? The new Spider Man movie. Far from home. In, Far that, from home. in that video they do a joke where Batman's about to say because I'm Batman, but he doesn't. Because I'm an adult and I can handle it. But then they had to f do it in the end. They like cram it in in the end after the credits thing, and he like calls up the scroll that's pretending to be Batman, and then he's like, "That's right, yeah." Did you say because I'm Batman? No. Nope. You gotta say because I'm Batman. You've gotta say because I'm Batman, and then he says why, and then he says because I'm Batman. It's like, dude, you couldn't even like do a joke sort of making fun of how overplayed your own joke is. Mm -hmm. You still had to have the joke because it's that class. It's that funny. It, it honestly reminds me of the type of shit I thought was just the most brilliant, like, comedy when I was in, like, year seven, which you're, what, 12, 13? Mm. Yeah. The thing is, I, I said earlier that I've watched it, but I, I never found it funny. I've never found it funny. I just either. watched it out of... Does anyone find it funny? The, look, if you find... If you're, like, a huge fan of Haishi... Haishi. Hishi. Hishi. Hi tell me in the comments why you find it, like, funny or whatever, because... I don't know what to tell you. Uh, it seems to me like it's meant to be more audience clap moment. You know? Yeah, we even went on one where it said, like, written by the fans or created yeah, by... Yeah, it shows, man. I mean, they all have always felt like they've been written by some sort of hive well, they, mind. Well, they're written by Reddit. Yeah. The hive mind. Yeah. If you didn't... If they completely removed the written by the fans, you wouldn't have known. No. It would have been the f same Maybe shit. they all are. Maybe it's like a Yo Mama situation. It's really similar to like that Yo Mama channel. Mm. Where it's just like, the channel is branded a certain way, so every video is just the same thing. Yeah. Every time. And it's for babies. Yeah, and of course it has to be for children. Because they're nearly at 10 million subs, so. And are they, they're growing as well. Of course they're growing. They're growing, and they're still just getting... A Their um, Avengers Endgame video I happened to see had uh, nearly 20 million views, so, I mean, they ain't struggling. Well, that means it's okay for us to... I just hope they're paying whoever is actually animating and doing the art for this stuff. Yeah. Or tracing or whatever. I hope that they're, they're, they're getting paid fairly. If you're, like, work as, like, an animator and you're pa paid pittance... Maybe try and get a raise, because, I mean, it ain't really showing. Like, it, that the money that is being made from this channel, it doesn't really show in the, like, no. the, the animation no, quality. It, it like doesn't show anywhere. The writing never got better. The voice acting never got better. The animation never got better. The only thing that has changed is the resolution. So, basic when they first started the channel, when they were getting YouTube money, they were using that money to, for the channel, and now they're making a hundred times that money, and they're still using the same amount of money to make the content. Yeah, basically. With loads of um, like product placement, Nord VPN like stuff in there yeah, as well. Yeah, so. sponsorships. It's one. It's one of those business channels where it's yeah. like, oh, like I made a few of these, and people like this. Let's just turn it into a business then. It's, like, it's we, not much. We've already different. perfected it. It's, it's like that attitude where Cinema Sense is like from the first video. Oh. We've done it. We've nailed the formula. We never need to change it again. Let's just do this until we literally can't do it anymore. Mm -hmm. It's the same shit. There's not much difference, really, when you think about it, to Watch Mojo. Yeah, I've thought about Watch Mojo as well. But Watch Mojo has more, mm -hmm. probably more value. Yeah. Yeah, I'd agree. Because at least it's information based. They have some stupid lists. But at the very least, some are like, oh, Point one of maybe ten was like interesting a little bit. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> so how should it have ended, guys? A long time ago. <laughs> Truthfully. Because I'm Batman. You see how unfunny that is? <laughs> that's the that's the 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 reason it should have ended. No, are you telling me that this isn't funny? Like, say, ask me how I did something. Um, uh, how did you manage to parallel park like that? Because I'm Batman. 
Do another do another one. How did you manage to cook that steak so so perfectly? Because my parents are dead. Another one. Uh Let's just do this for about 7 minutes. C keep going. How did you manage to get such a cute puppy? Because I'm Batman. Jim, one more. No, keep going. No, let's just keep going. Uh, 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 hey, I'm um, Spider-Man. I'm from a, another dimension, Spider-Man. You want to know why I'm upset, Spider-Man? Because my parents are dead. It's funny, isn't it? Because I'm bad. 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 No. Never will be. Never was. Never was. Never is. Never will be. Hissy. More like... Stanky titty. My parents are water. We are water. <laughs> Basically, don't watch this channel, it's shit. I think that about does it on our views on... Heish. Yeah, but it's like such a vapid like channel. Like it's just nothing to say. Nothing. Watch one video and you've seen all the videos. That's as simple really as. Yeah. The They're the problem of YouTube. Well, I won't leave that bit in. <laughs> They're killing YouTube. Listen, and I also heard that the guy, like the main guy, has killed someone. Yeah, he's also he's... dodging taxes with the amount of money he's getting from this shit. I've heard he's into like... <laughs> you know. What stays in... Mm-hmm. Because I'm Batman. He probably does walk around and say that because he's so f***ing rich. Oh, I just pushed you over. I'm rich. I'm I just Batman. pushed this uh, old man in front of a bus as per because I'm Batman, you know? That's what this, that's what this kind of guy's like. And it's not okay. He's it's a scumbag. He needs to be taken down. Yeah. Hashtag make it stop. And he's completely anonymous too. No one knows who he is. Does he even exist? Who even is the person who runs this goddamn f <laughs> Who is he? literally the first thing on the credits. Literally. Because he's the director. Yeah, but who director. actually is that? Director. Who actually is that though? Who is he? Where did he come from? What's his backstory? Nobody knows. His parents were killed. His name is Bruce. He can't keep getting away with this. <laughs> or can I? Yeah.